If you're looking for headphones, you're looking for every box ticked, great sound, noise cancelling, use them anywhere, poolside, beachside, everywhere you go, this is for you, the JBL Reflect Flow Pro. About 270 bucks in Australia, and for that, you're getting a lot of bang for your buck. Now, straight out of the box, without even touching another set of the many different um, fins and buds you can get, I'm getting a really comfortable fit here. And that's a really important thing because these headphones are made for the active. So these should be great at the gym and when you're running, and they should be a solid fit. So it's really important when you buy a set of headphones like this that you look for all the optional accessories in here, which are the, the I call it the shark fin, this bit here that, that sticks out of the earbud that allows you to ensure that you're getting a real hook in the ear. Because it's all well and good to have them, you know, shoved into your ear canal and getting a great fit for sound. But with these ones, you also want to make sure that you're getting a good fit for activity. Because that's what these are made for. These are made for gym junkies, runners, everyone. You could be running in the rain with these because they're IP68 rated. Um, you could be splashing around in the waves and they'll be fine. They won't actually work underwater because Bluetooth signal won't actually penetrate through water, but it's about those times when you need the waterproofing that you're gonna miss it if you don't have it. But most importantly, we have gotta check the sound. So I'm gonna have a little listen here to some music and I'm gonna give you my basic impressions of these headphones. I can tell straight away, I'm getting a real JBL sound. JBL have this, they call it a signature sound and it's true because what you get is clarity. You get clarity of voice, but you also get a real depth to the sound, depth to the music. So when a beat comes in, I really hear that. Now, obviously there's a whole range of songs that you could listen to, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw some Billy Joel, wow, we didn't start the fire. And you know that start bit, that just went beautifully from ear to ear. Um, just warming up now, it's a live version. Oh yeah, I can hear every part of the drum kit, every part. It's gorgeous. I'm going to skip ahead here for the vocals. Nasser and Prokofiev, Rockefeller, Campanella, Communist, Block. Yep. I think more than nearly any other headphones, I get a real uh, a culmination of sound. So a lot of headphones isolate the artist and give you bass. Um, what I feel here, and this is a live version I was listening to, so it's a bit different, but I really feel like I'm getting, I feel like I'm on stage. Like I feel like I'm getting the, the entire experience. And if you look at them, now straight on, you can definitely see them. Um, you know, it's not like they're right in my ear, but you know, I, I'm happy with that. But you know, side on, they're a good look. I mean, there's nothing wrong with the JBL logo. And then you start to talk about the control. So you've got some great adjustabilities in the app. Now this is primarily what I'm talking about here in the app you have so much control over the gestures, left and right ear. So we can actually choose what every gesture is on the left or right ear. So what I like to do is actually have pretty much the same thing on both sides, but because we've got left and right controls, I like tap for noise cancelling on and off. I keep that standard. Then you've got double tap for talk through, which is essentially like your ambient sound, and tap and hold will activate Siri. On the right side, that's where I want my play controls. Where That's where I want my music controls. Single tap to play or pause, double tap to track forward, triple tap to track back. That's a lot of settings on your earphone. So basically, I can now be out and about, uh, phone, in backpack, in pocket, wherever, um, and I can be out for a walk or a run, maybe not me, um, and I can control my music, no dramas at all, but I can also control that noise cancelling, that ambient noise cancelling. So one of the other things I want to test here is um, one of the big claims, I don't know if it's on the box, but it's definitely, I saw it on the website, voice clarity with six microphones. So basically they're saying that these headphones, the Reflect Flow Pro, should give you great phone calls. Now you know in previous videos I've done a full test of lots of different headphones. We'll do that again later in the year when we've got together kind of all the 2022 headphones. But let's now make a phone call and I'll record it over in the studio. I'll record the other end of the phone call and I'll throw on the cafe noise sound. So let's do that. All right we're ready. I've made a phone call and I'm using the JBL Reflect Flows. So uh, you're currently listening to me on my microphone and we're now going to switch over to the studio which is essentially 
the other end of this phone call. Now, this is me talking uh, through the headphones, chatting on the phone. Um, you know, I've got no doubt it's not as good as it just was, but it is uh, these headphones and that's how they sound. But I think the critical thing here now is how do they handle? They've got six mics and all this kind of stuff. How do they handle some background noise? So we've got some cafe noise on the TV. I'm going to play that at quite a loud volume. Now, what I find happens sometimes with these things is they need time to adjust to what is background noise, what is my noise. So I'm just going to talk here for a little while and just see what we get in terms of how it adjusts to that background noise. Now, imagine I was to walk outside. So let's turn that down gradually. I'm going to walk outside the cafe, essentially, or into a quiet place. And this is now a quiet background uh, with me still talking. But if I keep talking and walk back into that cafe now and the volume starts to come up, it'll be interesting to see, again, how it copes with that volume change. Now, making and taking phone calls, I don't think is a primary use of headphones these days, but it's, for some people, a really critical thing, and that's why I like to try and test it with every set we get. I reckon that's a pretty good demo of the noise cancelling. You could really hear how, it muffled, but I could hear, you could hear every word, but it had that muffled effect, because it's trying to deal with that extreme noise and then isolate the individual uh, speaker. I think it did a great job. Um, these Reflect Flow, Flow Pros uh, have a 10 hour in-ear battery life, a little bit less when you're always using noise cancelling, maybe you'll get eight or so, but they also come in this rear case here which has a bunch more battery in it. So you're getting days worth of battery on and off use. Essentially, this is a great thing to attach to your gym bag, uh, so you've always got your headphones ready to go. They've really upped this JBL branding, which I love because it's a good brand, it's a well-recognized thing, and there's nothing to be ashamed about using JBL headphones because they have such a great heritage in sound. The Reflect Flow Pros, try and say that three times fast, are made for the gym junkie, the active junkie. And I think just from fit and finish, I gotta tell you, um, these are the most snug headphones I've felt in some time. So if you do have that situation where you can't find something to fit you, trust me, you will. You'll find something to fit you here with the JBL Reflect Flow Pros. About 269 bucks available now and uh, well worth a look if you're a gym junkie or active outdoors type.